Mark Metis. The jump off. They've been tied to a bunch of different players this week. A couple of ex-Yankees seem to be on the radar. You got Grander, son. Oh, he's not an ex-Yankee yet. Slow down. <laughs> and uh, Phil Hughes. Would these guys work as Mets? Well, first off, you can have Phil Hughes. You know, I think I speak on behalf of, on behalf of every Yankee fan. You can have Phil Hughes. Uh, he's just terrible. His demeanor, everything about him, the expectations he came with, and what a letdown he became. You know, so Phil Hughes... I mean, I don't think he'll work anywhere right now, but he's not going to work with the Yankees. He'll come. He'll come cheap, right? I mean, he'll, he'll come definitely cheap. come cheap. Maybe in the National League, middle of the middle of the rotation guy for the Mets. The Mets need a, a couple back end guys. I don't know, man. I, I wouldn't <laughs> rely. I wouldn't rely on Phil Hughes based on what we've seen in New York. Clearly, he can't handle New York. Maybe the pressure's too high on the Yankees. I don't know, but I, well, I, he's know, a major risk. You know, pitching at City Field a little easier than pitching at Yankee Stadium, also known as the Little League Ballpark. I mean, come on. The right field porch at Yankee Stadium. There you fit. I'd love Yankee to see Stadium's you. I'd terrible. love to see you hit one out of there. I, I would love. Easily. Not even if you had an Easton Big Barrel 31 inch. You could not do it. Aluminum bat, you couldn't do it. Right, By the anyway, way, as far as Granderson goes. Granderson, I mean, Granderson, I take this guy. I take of, course, of course you would, because he puts up big numbers. The only thing I could say bad about Granderson is he strikes out a lot. Mm -hmm. Strikes out a lot, but he's always good for 40 home runs. Average okay, drives in a lot of runs. Great outfielder and a great guy to have on the team. Yeah, ambassador we of the this, sport. We met this guy. We sure did. Ambassador of the sport. He is. We he's, met him. He's a great spokesman for the for any team. At the All Star game, we were hanging with him a couple years ago. And you're right, uh, just a, uh, a great guy with the media, with the fans. He would just have to cross town, and I think the Met fans would embrace him more. Of course. Like a star like that, ready for the uh, not ready for the Browns, ready for Queens now. The the Mets would love to have Granderson, but we don't want to let him go. I don't want to let him go. I can't quit you, Granderson. No, no, we need him. Yeah, I mean, we want him back. Uh, health could be an issue with him, but I think he's staying in New York as a Yankee. Are you going to miss the, the lame calls? Grandy man and all those. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll definitely definitely miss that. Yeah, but let's keep him as a Yankee. You can have Phil Hughes as a Mets fan, all right? Thanks.